Hi everyone, so today I thought I would do something very exciting. The Christmas background is up, which means one thing only. It's a Christmas related video. Today I'm going to be doing a Christmas haul. This is everything that I bought recently to the lead up towards Christmas. Anything that I feel that like is Christmassy, whether that is decorations, clothing, just basically anything I think is Christmassy, I'm going to show you today, so I'm going to get straight into it. So I'm going to start off with something that everybody hates to receive at Christmas, but we all love getting. Christmas socks! I really wanted some Christmas socks this year. I went to Copenhagen to get into the Christmas spirit, and I was like, I need Christmas socks for this trip. And I picked up a five pack from Primark. We had these really cute red ones, then we had these like little... Um, blue ones with little trees on and then we have like a bunch in here as well they were three pound for a pack of five and i will wear them all year round most probably but i thought to get into the christmas spirit why not get some christmas socks another item i can wear and that is a pair of tartan pajamas i have a button down brush cotton set right here also from primark which was about eight pounds and i love getting one of these every year i had one last year that i still won't wear now and i have like a christmas pudding one as well and i just love getting these every year they're so comfortable they keep you really nice and warm and they just look so cute and festive i have another thing from primark primark are great when it comes to inexpensive christmas related items i love going there just to get some christmas bits and it's cheap and easy to fill your room up and make it look christmasy when you go to primark and these my sister picked up for me and yes just just look at them my sister picked them up i looked at them before and i was like oh no i won't get them and she was like they are so comfortable you should get a pair and i was like why the hell not i'm gonna get myself a pair of gingerbread knitted leggings they are so freaking comfortable as soon as i finish filming this video i'm going to put them on um, i love them they make me feel festive i would never go out in them they were 10 pounds so a lot of money for like a pair of leggings that you're only going to wear a few times a year. But I would never go out in them unless I'm in the car with my sister and we're going for like a drive through. But around the house they keep you warm, they look so funky and I just, I just love them. Christmas wouldn't be Christmas without a Christmas jumper. And I really got into Christmas jumpers last year and this year I decided to get another one. And I got this really cute one. If you've watched any of my other Christmas related videos you would have seen this. But I got this one from Asda. I really love it. It's sadly sold out on the website, but I'd definitely go check in store to see if they have it. I'll check on the website and see if they have it at any more stock. But when I last checked, it was sold out. It was about 14 to 16 pounds, and I just, I just love it. It's got a bit of pink, it's got navy, it's got red, it's fluffy in places, and it's just so comfortable. It's one of those ones that's not like, oh my god, I'm a Christmas jumper. It's more, I'm a wintery jumper until you get up close and you see the candy cane. Another thing which you might have seen in my recent videos, and it's this, this little antler headpiece. I was saying to my mum, I really wanted a pair of like antlers or like a little hat or something to wear when I film some Christmassy videos with my sister. And she got these from H&M Kids section, and they are just so freaking adorable. They were like three pounds. The woman in the shop thought my mum had a child until my mum turned around and said, oh no, it's for my 22 year old daughter. And I think the woman may have been a bit shocked until my mum explained that I did YouTube and the woman was quite like happy about that. But they're just really adorable. They're like these little glittery coloured antlers with little ears and a cute little red bow. And they're just, just adorable. Look, look how cute they are on. And I think I'm just gonna wear them now for the remainder of the video. Another hair accessory and it is these glitter hair bows. I wanted something cute that I could wear maybe out and about and feel Christmassy because I can't really get away wearing these out and about and I saw these on Etsy by a brand called Little Pretties by Emma I'll leave it linked down below for you and these came in a set of three for something like £1.50 and she had a deal one as well where you can get like 10 or 20% off so I paid next to nothing for these and they are just adorable they're really well made You've got um, a red and silver one, a gold and red one, and then a red one with a little bit of gold on it. And I just think they're going to look really cute in my hair when it's curly. Or when my hair's up in like a ponytail. Just to bring some like little festive cheer without being OTT. Something else that my mum picked up for me, and it's just something I absolutely love. She is adorable. It's this little angel. This is from Matterland, and Matterland this year have done some really lovely Christmas decorations. And she, I just, I just love her so much. I saw her in there and I was like, I really, really want it. And then I come back from Copenhagen, my mum had surprised me with her on my little windowsill. And she's just, 
the most freaking adorable thing ever. My mum said that she has been through the wars a little bit. She did lose her head ever so slightly, but I just love her so much. I think she's absolutely adorable. She was £10, but because she did have her head missing, I got her a little bit cheaper, but I'm just so over the moon with her. I will make sure to link this down below if they have it, but if not, go check out your local Massalan to see if they have one in store because she's just adorable and I'm so glad I have her. So I recently went to Copenhagen and I went to a Christmas market and I picked up a couple of decorations. The first one is this really adorable like ceramic Christmas tree. I absolutely love this. I just think it's really simple but it actually looks absolutely beautiful on the tree. This was about £3. And then I also picked up this cute little bauble which is just like a wooden bauble which has been painted white and has little red dots on it. And I just absolutely love these. I like the fact that I have something from Copenhagen that will be on my tree. And every year I put my tree up, I can remember my trip to Copenhagen. My sister picked this up for me recently. And it's this just really cute Christmassy cushion with some stags on it. She got this from Primark and it was like £3 in the sale. Definitely go check to see if they have it still because she only got it like a week ago. And it's really cute and it sits on my bed. And I also got brand new bedding. And I just love this. This is from Massaland. It costs... £25 and it just looks so Christmassy. It's brush cotton and it just feels amazing to sleep in. Now on to my wrapping sort of stuff. I recently placed an order on the works and it's basically just this website that does loads of wrapping paper, ribbon, cro like just everything craft related. They have a few stores as well and it's really really cheap. I picked up um, two similar ribbons. They are like this hemp style sack um, ribbon with like red glitter patterns all the way around this one's stags and snowflakes and this one is just snowflakes these are four meters what like long and they are a pound each and i have a really great idea of how i'm going to use these i'm just going to wrap them up and make a big bow on my presents i also got this teeny tiny ribbon which is just red with little white um threading through it and this was a pound for three meters i thought this would be great for like little presents that i have and just make every present like really Christmassy and girly. And then the last lot of ribbon is stuff that I've actually used. I had a bigger version of this one here on this and I've already used it because I wrapped up a couple of people's presents with it. And then I also have this don't open before, until the 25th of December, a little gingham one and then the opposite colours to the one that was up here. This was £2 and they were 2 meters each. So really, really, really cheap like for ribbon and the last bit is my wrapping paper but firstly if you're one of the collab girls and you haven't received your secret santa yet and you don't know if i am your secret santa do not watch this part of the video as you will ruin it so i wanted to do something a little bit different this year with my wrapping paper i actually wanted to create something that you can't really buy in the shops and when you can buy in the shops it's very expensive so i bought some brown wrapping paper from matterland i bought three rolls of this and it was three for two and they were two pound each so i paid four pounds for how much is that 12 meters which is really really good and then what i decided to do with the brown paper to jazz it up a little bit is i bought a bunch of ink pads and some stamps and what i've done is i've just printed um loads of different patterns all over the paper i've got ones with baubles all over and ones with snowflakes and ones that say Merry Christmas and everything and loads of them are all different colours. I have red, green and like a silver colour and I just really wanted to make my own wrapping paper this year so it's really rustic and homemade and with the ribbon it's just going to look really really cute. So that was my Christmas haul. I hope it made you feel all Christmassy. I have a couple of more Christmas videos coming up before the end of December so keep your eyes peeled for those. If you did enjoy this video please give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, go hit that subscribe button. And I will see you all in my next video. Bye.